this is really it takes a lot of patience it's testing my patience and i'm really not sure if i would try out this style again but we already started so let's get this is our finish and let's do this my hair is so i don't know what's happening with my hair but it it just got a knot again so hi guys so i am back oh my word the lighting looks amazing oh my word okay guys so i am back i just washed my hair as you can see i left on a hair mask or mask um i'm gonna leave this like on my hair for five minutes then i'm gonna rinse, rinse my hair off but i just want to show you guys what what brand i use i normally use to wash my hair i completely love this brand it's not like a natural hair brand but i love it my hair loves it so this is the alvive l'oreal alvive um the thickening shampoo and then i also have the thickening mask cue so this is like a mask that you leave on your hair or like a deep conditioner that you leave on your hair for five minutes and then this is the shampoo so what i normally do is this is my wash routine i wash my hair with the shampoo but i wash my scalp though because it does contain silver so i am very like cautious with that i know that you know i should only wash my scalp and then as i wash my scalp um the soap will clean as it comes down it will clean my hair if you know if you get me i hope you get me so i wash my scalp with the same poo then i don't apply conditioner i leave the conditioner for last because i do apply it as a leave in remember and if you are on my facebook and instagram which you should be then you should know that i use it as a leave in so it's only like a good idea to use it last because i use it as a leave in you get me so after washing my scalp with shampoo i obviously rinse the shampoo off and make sure that i completely completely rinse the shampoo off then i try to not really sex in my hair but try to make like two two parts then i apply my the mask on the ends of my hair i focus focus more on the ends and the length of my hair i am pretty sure that i don't apply on my scalp because yeah i don't apply on my scalp because my scalp already has oils so i want to make sure that my length and my ends which is the driest gets the most moisture so yeah this is what i use and then this is the shampoo that i use i just want to read because i know a lot of people see the shampoo and they underestimate um the shampoo um Hello, Muti. This shampoo owner Scotty. This is like buy a buy a good, so don't underestimate the shampoo. Um, just because it's like affordable and cheaper. So the shampoo I've noticed with the shampoo and conditioner and this um mask you that it really makes your hair thicker. So it makes your hair fiber thicker with each wash, and you will start to see you like when I started my natural journey, my hair was very very thin because I was like blowing it out a lot. I was straightening my hair every single day with a straightening iron so or a straightening tongue so um my hair became very 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 thin and i knew that no you know this is not good for my hair but because i wanted thinner hair yeah my entire to thinner i almost not moisture so i really wanted my hair to be like thin because if your hair is like more thin um it doesn't mince a lot you know or boom <laughs> a lot so um that's also not good if your hair mince a lot or boom a lot then it's actually very good because your hair is thick it's actually so don't get mad or angry when your hair boom a lot it's actually a sound for me personally i'm not like a, a hair specialist or a hair um what do you call it like professional whatever didn't study that so um but i did notice that when my hair mins or my hair pom when i blow it out then my hair is actually very 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 healthy so because it's the fiber my hair fiber is very thick and it's not thin and yeah some people just have naturally thin hair but i know that i don't have thin hair when my hair becomes thin it's actually not healthy it's not healthy hair. so 
so just wanna read for you so this was like the perfect conditioner and shampoo like the perfect perfect brand for me because i wanted my hair from thin to back to its normal texture so this really helped me um in the beginning and it still helps me my hair grows extremely fast um not just because of the shampoo and the conditioner but it really gives me a lot of moisture the moisture that i need um and um yeah and it just fits in my routine so my whole routine makes my hair to grow but this is a part of you know it also helps helps a lot so i just want to read here um so it says that um okay so l'oreal have created our first hair care range that is proven to increase the thickness of the hair fiber and yeah um, um yeah it basically like ex it penetrates the hair fiber and it expands it so yeah um hair looks thicker wash after wash penetrates and hair instantly expands long lasting effect and it gives body and bounce so yeah um i want you guys to read behind um read here it will actually give you guys an idea of like what the shampoo and conditioner does and yeah you sh i always say that you should always make sure that you use it correctly i know that the shampoo contains sulfates but it's how you use it and like yeah how do you put it in your routine I make sure that when I wash my hair with sulfates, I make sure that my hair is dirty, my scalp is dirty, my hair is dirty. So I'm not gonna wash clean hair with sulfates. I'm gonna wash like five days or four days hair with sulfates so that sulfates can clean my scalp. And yeah, sulfates, cause when I wash my hair with the shampoo, oh my word, like my hair becomes instantly clean. My scalp becomes instantly clean. Like with sulfate free, I have to like wash my hair twice in order for my hair to become clean or my scalp to become clean. So with this, like I love immediately when I put it on my hands and I put it through my, my scalp, my scalp feels clean after that and ready to be moisturized. So then I apply this and I leave it on for five minutes. I think five minutes we I think we're over five minutes so i have to rinse this off now then i will make the hairstyle i'm so excited to make this hairstyle i'm so excited because i will be trying it out with you it's my first time trying this out so i really don't know how the results are going to look but you are going to be with me and i'm going to show you guys and it's going to be both of us first time seeing this hairstyle so stick with me okay guys so i actually just realized that I have to detangle my hair first before I start with the twist because my hair is very 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 tangled and that is my own fault because nowadays I don't detangle my hair a lot so um, I shouldn't only detangle on one day I should detangle um, like at like three times a week at least but nowadays i don't know what's happening with me i only detangle on wash day and that is not good so i just realized that i first need to detangle my hair and then um start with this hairstyle which is gonna actually be longer but yeah we have to do this so let me start <music>
actually I had to detangle my hair off camera because my hair was really irritating me because it was just so 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 tangled and it just made the style like very 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 difficult because I couldn't get the lines to be straight because obviously my hair is tangled it's mixed with it's just knotted together and it was just not <sighs> not 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 nice but like I detangled it now off camera because I just felt like nah uh -uh, uh -uh, let me stop and, and just try to detangle all of my hair before I go on because like I don't like to feel like irritated and you know with my hair so and um, my hair being so tangled and having f knots and stuff it just it just made this it's just making the style very 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 um difficult well let's go on but i really love the i really love this i really love this so i'm gonna go on now hopefully now it will be better so yeah let's start again let's let's be positive i must say though this is a style that you need a lot of patience for this so if you don't need if you don't have patience and if you don't have the time then i don't suggest you trying out this hairstyle because like i was thinking now this is really takes a lot of patience it's testing my patience and i'm really not sure if i would try out this hairstyle again but we already started so let's get this hairstyle finished and let's do this what's happening with my hair but it it just got a knot again so I really don't know what's happening with my hair um never used to do this what is happening with this hair to look after your mental health because in during this time because it, it, it is easy to to start to worry to a point where you you know you're so scared of the future and you're so scared of tomorrow and next month so it is important to just try to keep yourself busy and try not to think too much about about tomorrow and about you know um, what's gonna happen um, I make sure that I wash my hands and I make sure that I am prepared or I am cool um, careful I wash my hands a lot and I always also remind my partner to wash his hands because um, yeah He's also very cautious and very careful because that's what we need to be but we we don't I don't think that it is healthy for you to worry too much about what's gonna happen that is where the problem comes in is when you worry because then as soon as you worry you you create that you know that negative atmosphere in the house around your friends around your f yeah around people in the house and in the house so it is important to just stay positive because like i told my sister the other day that when you're positive you are you're not gonna forget a lot of stuff you see when you neg when you start to worry a lot you start to get de depressed and then um 
when you're depressed you stress a lot and you forget a lot of stuff because of stress so it is important to keep your me- look after your mental health in this time so that you don't forget stuff you don't forget to wash your hands because now we are washing our hands more than before lockdown so you wanna you know always remind yourself like me i always have to remind myself to wash my hands after everything you know after i opened up uh opened up a box of cereal or you know just anything that you got in the shop and money and yeah just it is important to always remind yourself because we're not used to washing our hands like uh, so a lot so how are you gonna do that if you stress and you worry and you negative you know you're not gonna look after yourself you're not gonna look after your hands and you know after your body and yeah we don't want that so it is important and sometimes people can confuse that they can confuse that with yeah you're not you don't care about this thing you don't take this thing serious no you are taking it serious it's just that you you try to stay you just want to stay positive you are taking it serious because you are washing your hands You are making sure that you always like follow the rules, stay in the house and stuff like that. So you are taking it serious. It's just that you don't want to worry too much. Yeah, because I've been through depression and it's not a nice thing to go through. So you really don't want to go through that. So keep yourself busy. And... Yeah, you will be okay. I'm gonna do this off camera because I don't want this video to be too long as too long. So as soon as I get to the front part, I will see you guys again. So this is the final result of my hair I felt so 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 cute in this hair and I felt like no I needed to change my t-shirt and put on something cute um, something cute to fit this hairstyle but I must say that I really 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 love this it was very difficult to do and very time consuming but I am in love with this hairstyle for five days because I have to make this hairstyle worth it okay I can't go like um, only two days three days no I'm gonna go like oh if I can even go a whole week with this hairstyle that could be nice I really hope you guys enjoyed my video please make sure that you subscribe
to my channel please let me know what you think of this hairstyle and if you would try it at home please let me know down in the comments below don't forget to subscribe don't forget to like don't forget to comment let me know how i look and yeah i will see you guys in the next video bye